go hire Bo Deedle for real and, and ruin your well, life. Well, Bo That's Deedle how I is fight. Ins- That's how I Bo fight. Bo Deedle d- is insistent. I sent you the video. He is ticked off. He's pissed. He said that, oh, that Luis Relajas had no right using his name. Now, let me address that for a minute. Whether Bo gave him information or not, whether Bo was hired or not, it doesn't he matter. Says he everyone, he says he wasn't. Everyone's saying, oh, well, maybe he wasn't hired. Maybe he just gave him the inter. It doesn't matter if he did or not. You never throw someone like that his name around. You just don't. He's you saying, don't. no, you don't. And he's saying that he had, you know, first of all, he's saying that there'd be a non-disclosure agreement if I, he did hire me, but he's like, he never hired me. I'm going to be very clear. And he yeah, said- Yeah, but then people are twisting it. I'm taking my bathroom up. People are twisting it, saying, oh, he didn't hire him. They're friends. He calls him Uncle Bo, so he did it for free. Okay, that's what people are doing. Listen, I I don't give a shit. I don't give a shit whether he did it or not for free. My problem is that Louie threw his name around. That's what what Bo's mad about. And by the way, oh, I know. And by the way, Bo said- Bo said, I read an article, he said, but just, I want to make it clear. If I looked into every cast member and Margaret, the, he's like, that would be, you know, hundreds of thousands of dollars in my feet. Just to FYI, he put that out yeah. there. And then did you see, he said that he ran into Melissa a few months ago at, at a, in, in New York City. And Melissa, no. apparently, according to The Sun, he did an exclusive interview. He, he was sitting at a table next to Melissa and Melissa had the audacity to open her trap. And this is this is from Bo's mouth in this article that Melissa looked over and said, oh, you're the guy looking into me, looking into all of us. And Bo's like, let me tell you something. I ain't looking, I have no, I ain't following you, girl. If, if I was following, so Melissa's a big shot over there speaking. He was sitting with his boys. This is, I'll, I'll send you the article. This is from Bo's mouth. He's like, oh and she looked over, God. I guess they were seated next to each other. And she said, you're the guy looking into all of us. And Bo's like, Honey, I ain't following you. Trust me. If I was looking into you, I would know everything about you. So just wow. go, turn around and go eat your pasta. Yep. Wow. That's All of great. a sudden, Melissa has big balls. Are you kidding me? Because she don't. Yeah, got why didn't she do that? Why didn't she do that when she saw Laura? Why didn't you remember they were at the same restaurant? Oh, why didn't she yes. do that then? Remember that? Why didn't you do that then? Wow. Teresa's honey. Teresa's done. So. You know, here here we go. We have two more parts and Andy's like, but I mean, she is, listen, I mean, we could just be all over the place today. You know, then you have the pause and I don't know what's going to happen, but I mean, to, if they figure this, look, they don't want to get rid of Melissa because they- No, would, of course not. But Teresa, is she's, I mean, she's really done. Well, here's the thing. I l- listen, I'm not going to make a prediction right now. I made it to a few of my friends, but not right now. But let me just tell you this. I personally feel that Louis is phenomenal TV. He lies like a rug. He's wild. You never like one minute. He's running up to the car. I love you. I love you. The next minute he's saying to Teresa, you know, we hate him. This He's listen. He's Danielle Staub, but a man. They have a new Danielle Staub. You know, I'm like, he's great TV. So, I mean, it's good. This is a very difficult situation for them. It really is because no matter how much people say they hate the drama between Joe and Melissa, here's the problem. Joe Gorga with the boys, people love that. They love it. And so this is why when you say a pause. They have a real problem. No, there's a there's a real problem. I think they're going to get their shit together by September and they're going to film the holidays. That's my opinion. You know, it could not be. It could because this is a real problem, a real yep, problem, a real you know, problem. So, you know, I, mean, I can't predict. listen. It, it, then the other thing is people like don't realize that. I, I mean, this I know for a fact. There's only a pause because they don't know what to do. Everyone Correct. out there who's saying there's a pause because of Louis and his alleged no. you know, illicit business practices, they, they no. don't care. They will literally keep Louis on the show until Absolutely. the wheels fall off and, and the feds come and he's just like they like did Jen the Jen Shaw. Yes, of course. Same thing. It don't matter. Everyone, it, it's they don't care. They don't care. They, they don't care about that. When Louis goes to jail, if he goes, oh, if he's God. up to anything. Oh, God. Oh, God, what? 
Oh God, if he does, I'm just saying, if he does, I don't know. What, well, you know, if he does, I mean, of- but I mean, it, it, should that ever happen, the, Bravo will no longer care. They will move on with their lives. They care. They no. don't care about anyone. They don't care. So that's really not don't. why there's a pause. There's a pause no. because they don't want to fire Melissa. They don't. If and they, they did, don't want to fire Teresa. Fire they don't want- they're not yeah. firing Teresa. No, never. But I'm just saying. I know. There could be, if there, things were a really. Problem. Yeah. There, what, this is what I think they should do. Andy, if you're listening to me, listen to me. Okay. I think you should make Teresa double dip. Give Teresa her own little show. You know, a little show with her and her kids and Louie. The ratings and are huge, sweetheart. Yeah, give her her own little show and let her double dip. Let her keep coming into the housewives and filming with whoever. You know, one side of the couch was one way, the other. So that might be your answer. Double dipping for Teresa. Keep Melissa and Joe on. And, you know, listen, it, it, it's going to be difficult. And it might cost you a little bit more money. You know, but that's what I would do. I mean, Double Teresa dip. says on the thing where Andy's like, what's going on? And she's like, well, I'm not filming. I mean, she basically said, I'm not going to film with her anymore. So Andy's sitting there like, we have a real problem. Like, he saw the wheels. I mean, it's not going to be yeah. this. Even if Teresa's on, it, listen, she could have her own show and be on this the same amount of time. But I mean, what? We're going to have two fucking storylines and the two people are net. I mean, this I've this never been done in history. Well, I don't even know how that could be done. I, I don't never even been... know how this could be done. Honestly. They could do it. They could do it now. Years ago, they'll be in the same ago. room and not speak, I guess. Go on. Yeah. Yeah. Years ago, when Jacqueline, uh, Teresa comes in Jacqueline's backyard and Jacqueline confronts her about all these articles about Teresa might be facing jail. And Teresa was sideswiped. She was like, what? Like, I'm not going to jail like that. And then all of a sudden, Caroline comes around the corner and she's bombarded. That night, that night she felt sideswiped and she ran to Dina's house that Dina had not spoken to her in two years. Dina sent a Dear John letter to everyone that continued on the show and said, as long as you're on the show, I can't be around you. Okay. And then Teresa went knocking on her door that night. What do you mean she sent? Why? I don't get it. Because she was like, I'm done with this show. After that reunion, I'm done. And anyone who's on the show, I can't be around you. That's what she did. 1,000%. I know that for a fact. Sent them all a letter, email, whatever the fuck it was. So now, that night, Teresa was so shocked. Now, let me let me tell you why. She had this nowhere one. else to turn but Dina. Right. So now, I believe, through very good sources, that that was set up by the producers. They were saying, this is what you need to do, okay, for the drama. And I believe the same thing is happening now with with in Margaret's mind. Let's let's take down Teresa. You're not going to do it. They didn't do it then. Teresa stayed on the show, and they all were.